In this video, we're going to take you through your ZTE modem EWAN service configuration if you have not received a ZTE from Superloop. All our modems come pre-configured. First thing you're going to need is one of these. Connect your modem to the optical network terminal or network termination device or fiber box via the WAN port of your modem using an ethernet cable. Make sure it's plugged into the wall and the power is on. You should see a solid green light for the power icon. Underneath the modem is the SSID or Wi-Fi password. Use this to locate the Wi-Fi name on your computer and then join the network. Now, don't worry. When you successfully join the network, it will say no internet secured. This is because we haven't configured or set it up yet. If the ZTE modem is provided by Superloop, it's auto configured and should connect to the internet. If it's from elsewhere, the below is what you'll need to do. Open the internet browser on your computer or phone and type in 192.168.20.1. You can also check the bottom of your modem for the correct IP address if that doesn't work. You'll be prompted for a username and password. Ready for it? Username in lowercase, admin. Password is haikui underscore v2. Capital H, lowercase a i k u i, underscore, capital V, and then the number two. Once logged in, click on your WAN settings. You should then select the Ethernet tab and Superloop underscore EWAN. Click on the bin icon to delete the current configuration. Click on Create New Item. Enter Superloop underscore ETH WAN for connection name. Type routing. Link type IP. IP version IP v4 slash v6. Click Apply once done. Your modem should go online within two to four minutes. Please test the service once done.